Thanks for having me again, um, Olive. It's good to be here. Um, I'm just, it's been interesting to see how this entire trial is panning out and just seeing all the arguments that the different um, sides are bringing in. But just as the judges are trying, um, asked um, on what you've said, I remember, I think it's uh, Justice Woken who asked the other days, like, okay, so when this happens, aren't you able to come and say, okay, this is not this is not um, what I was commissioned to do. Are you not, is, has it become such a place where, um, has it become such a place where that you can't even reach out to the chair that he's so unreachable? So I'm just like the judges waiting out to see the answers that this um, teams will give. Um, I don't think there's much more other than whatever has, has been asked, but I'm just like every other Kenyan waiting to, to see and hear. Uh, what what will happen? What what what? These questions that the judges have mentioned are the questions that I think that are on every Kenyan's mind. Like let's see, let's see the proof. What's what's? The, I think the proof is in the pudding. So as every party is alleging, um, just hope waiting to see those answers come out. Okay. Uh, how about you? Any questions stand out for you uh, based on the submissions made by either side? I know uh, that uh, yesterday a lot of fun was uh, made of. Uh, I think it was Smokin, right? Uh, who took Kyoko Kilukumi to task over his use of the story of the of Solomonic wisdom. You know, mm -hmm. when the two women were both claiming uh, having mothered this child. What what questions? Right. Um, I think for me, if if you look at the the questions that the that the judges asked yesterday, are really comprehensive and really wise questions that seeks to probe more to understand you know what really you know went into the argument that both sides are trying to bring forth and for me I think the question that really stood out and that I think um, um, it will be interesting to hear from the uh, the defense side is on the constitutional role uh, of the the Commission the Commission the, the, the commissioners the seven uh, commissioners, uh, because like one of the judges said, I think it's Justice Ndungu, that it appears like um, even the, the CEO appears to have more power compared to the other, the other the commissioners, you know, who are really uh, vetted by the, the National Assembly, and whereas the, the CEO is someone who's really just hired, you know, by the commission to perform certain tasks. So I think that that will really be an interesting uh, bit to, to see, you know. Um, the, they have claimed that, you know, uh, the roles that they have been allocated are not in the Constitution, you know, per what the IBC officials are supposed, I mean, uh, commissioners are supposed to discharge. And so I think it will be really interesting to see uh, how the other side rebattles, uh, I think, beginning today.